welcome back to my channel. My name is Rebecca. Like, subscribe. It is Advent season. It is December. Are you want to take my watch? Yes, it is December 7th. It's been December 7th all day. I'm at the end of my day. I just got home from work and yes, I'm going to drink some coffee. All right. <laughs> I shouldn't at this time, but I'm going to do it because I got to get my calendar done. So um, yeah, I'm doing my Advent calendars. Both are from Aldi. Um, so we have do, 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 do it. You see the tree. See, so yeah, you get to see the tree all lit it up, lit it up for you. Um, so our our calendars are. We have the coffee from the Aldi, the barista mall. If I can get it back open again, there we go. There it is for all to enjoy and see. Um, so today's day seven coffee. I've got a little cat trying to get in my lap here. Um, <laughs> you're not. I know. Um, today's coffee. It's a very Christmassy flavor. Chocolate cherry coffee. It's kind of like those chocolate cordial things you see. You see, um, as soon as I hit record, the cats start going crazy. Um, it's like those little, those cherry cordial things that you get um, around this time of year. So that's kind of festive. And once again, they are really honing in on these this um, 70s Christmas vibe here. Look at those, look at those little gloves and those 70s colors. Um, so here we go. I have it in my lovely, lovely, lovely fa la 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 my mug that I got many moons ago at the Five and Below. It's very bitter. Not very good. Okay. All right. Um, it's like I said, I've got a kitty cat trying to get in my lap. All right. So I just feel little needle nails, little needle nails down there. Um, needle toes. Um, <laughs> So the the uh, chocolate cherry coffee, not a winner winner chicken dinner thus far. Um, so also also I showed this the day before yesterday. I have the the Advent flame burning. I guess you can call this. If they didn't have them this year, I didn't see them. But if they did at your store, let me know. But um, as far as I know, this is from last year. So I'm gonna call this my retro all the Advent calendar. The the Advent flame burns on for us tonight. Um, so I also have the milk chocolate calendar from the Aldi and December 7th is right here. Let's see if I can get it out of its little container. Oh, look at that. And it's a cute little angel. There you go. Christmas angel. Christmas angel. Look at that. Oh, so uncanny. All right. And I have that. And the tradition is, it's good. Um, we're going to chase it down if it proves the coffee. Not really. Even with the chocolate. No, but, but I must be honest, I'm not really a chocolate cherry person. Usually when I get those for Christmas, I give them to someone else. I'm like, here, you want these? I don't enjoy the um, cherry cordial things. Um, what else is happening? Oh, yes. I don't know if I showed this because I'm starting to get very forgetful. Uh, I got these in the past week at the Aldi. Now, okay, so they put out PJs about a week ago. And I saw these. My PJs are starting to get a little worn out that I got probably about four years ago, three or four years ago. I can't remember when they were exactly. But um, they had Christmas flamingo print. <laughs> and um, so this is this is kind of like, you know, taking me back to my childhood. My mom loved flamingos. And um, so when the Christmas flamingo thing started happening, she, used to, she had a flamingo like table with like her tree with her flamingo stuff. She had flamingo lights. I remember one year as a joke, I had, she had like one flamingo that had broken and she was gonna throw it away. So I took it out and I decorated it. Um, basically, I took like a little a little ornament bulb, red one, and I glued it to its little beak. And I made little antlers out of that little pipe cleaner thing. And then I bought like at the dollar, back in the Dollar Tree when you could get things, I bought a plunger. And I remember I spray painted the handle white and then I took red ribbon to make it look like a candy cane and stuck it in the in the um, the flamingo. And then I put a bow, like one of those cheap Christmas wrapping stick-on bows, and then I did fancy writing along the plum plumber, the plunger, and then I named him Reuben the Red Nosed Flamingo. So my mom had him. She thought it was hilarious, and she used to put him out every year after that with her other little flamingo items. So so um, my mom's no longer with us, but so this reminded me of my mom and when I made her Reuben the red nose flamingo, Christmas flamingo. 
So, so that's why I got these. I thought they were super cute. It just reminded me of that, that, that memory. So I'll be wearing these this year for Christmas. All right, enough of that. Oh, I also got these. I hadn't found them in a couple of weeks, and I'm starting to feel really, really sad. And um, I went in today. I was actually on the phone with a friend. I was like, I don't think they'll have them anymore. They've moved on to other cookies. And there they were. I, I rounded the corner. And there they were on the cookie aisle. I was so happy. They usually have them up near, near the register by Aldi, but um, they were actually in with all the rest of the cookies. And I was just like the happiest person ever, the thumbprint cookies. These are my jam. I look forward to these every year. They are delicious. If you've not had one, go try it at the Aldi if your Aldi has it. It's delicious. Mm. This is like, mm, so good. And those little hot cocos. Is this what the hot cocos you get at Aldi? That is Christmas to me right there. Mm-hmm. That's what I'm saying. Aldi, you need to get your life together and do a hot cocoa advent calendar. Just saying. Hire me in. I'll be on your marketing team. All right. Um, so that is what I have to show off. Oh, I also got a pair of socks. I got these probably... I think I got these on um, Veterans Day weekend because they had them on the sale. They had like a um, coupon. I can't remember how much I paid for them in the end. But um, they had some little cat socks. So my feet will be warm with kitty cat socks this year. I'm, I'm ridiculous when it comes to socks and pajamas and leggings. Um, I did get all my leggings out. So Saturday I will start donning the Christmas, the Christmas wardrobes. For work, I think it's going to be Saturday. It's going to be Saturday or the following Monday. I got to count how many outfits I have all together here. So I'll start donning my Christmas apparel. Fa la 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 la. Um, fun times had by all. Um, so yeah, got my socks. I um, got my my thumbprint cookies. I am geared up for the holidays. Let's see if I can try. Mm, deliciousness. Oh, I keep knocking the camera with my food. Um, got my my um, flamingo Christmas pajamas. I put my um, ornaments on the tree that I showed you yesterday. There's that little guy there. My little tree is here. I also got uh, um, another student gave me um, client and gave me um, right now it's right out there and I can't get to it. Um, we have it decorating. Um, so she gave me a lovely poinsettia. We have it off to the side over here. Um, so thank you. It was very thoughtful. Um, so yeah, I, I, I enjoy, I enjoy the Christmas. I enjoy the Christmas decorations, the lights. I'm always so sad when it ends. I get really, really sad and bummed out. And I'm like, I'm just going to keep them up. I'm just going to keep them up. Maybe we'll make a Valentine's tree. Cause I just love the lights. They cheer me up. Um, I think that's all I have today. Yes. So what did we learn? Rebecca loves thumbprint cookies and buying Christmas crap at every store, such as her flamingo pajamas that remind of her mom's flamingo collection. Um, that's a happy little memory. And the flamingo she made her mom named Reuben. Um, I got me some cat socks about a month ago. Um, today's flavor was the chocolate cherry coffee. Was I mean, it's a very good Christmas flavor. I will say that about this calendar so far this year. If I remember correctly, last year's, there were some flavors like, eh, okay. But I, I think this is a good Christmas flavor, the execution. But I'm also not a fan of that stuff. I, I didn't really care for it. I'll add creamer. I'll give you an update tomorrow if I can remember to do so. But I wasn't a big fan of the chocolate cherry. Let's try it again. Yeah, no, no. Um, but if you like chocolate cherry, you, you will, this will be your jam. It's like This is like coconut to me. Chocolate cherry and coconut. Yeah. Um, so... I had my lovely milk chocolate calendar. Um, we have the Advent flame burning on, burning on for us for this holiday season. This is the throwback from last year. I got it end of season. I bought a lot of stuff end of season last year. That's how you shop. That's how my grandma taught me how to shop. She's like, get it in the season. Get a head start on your shopping and save some money. Put it in a box in your closet. Um, with your wrapping paper you got on sale in the season. So that's usually when I start my Christmas shopping the week, the days after Christmas. I do my first round and then things that are on sale, like in the fall, things will go on sale and then Christmas. Um, so um, 
I that's what I usually do. Sometimes I don't get my life together, but last year it, it got together and I got some things on sale. So that's about all I have to say today. As a far stump says, that's all I have to say about that. Um, so I will see you tomorrow. I'm holding on dear life to this cookie. And I will see you tomorrow. Like, subscribe, get to Aldi, buy you a thumbprint cookie and you can hold on to it too. Um, so I will see you guys tomorrow for day eight. I'm telling you, it just flies. Advent, Advent calendar videos fly by. They, I just, I'm just come to accept it. So tomorrow, December 8th. Um, oh, also, before I go, tomorrow, I'll tell you about this tomorrow, but tomorrow I might be ordering some concert tickets to an Animant concert. I'll tell you about that tomorrow. I'll give you an update. So like, subscribe. As the Advent calendar turn returns tomorrow, and I'll give you that update. Um, so I'll see you then. Bye.